Hello everybody, I am Dr. Bhagirath Raghuraman, working as Senior Consultant Cardiologist and Program Director of Heart Transplant at Narayana Health City, Bengaluru. Heart failure is a condition wherein the heart is unable to pump enough blood to meet the circulatory needs. So in heart failure, there are various forms of treatment. However, there is end stage heart failure or a condition wherein the heart failure is less than 25% the overall left ventricular ejection fraction and for these patients they have been through many many forms of treatment including medicines wherein there is not enough or inadequate response to treatment and these patients do not recover and they further and further deteriorate till they eventually would die. Now heart transplant comes as an option for these end stage heart failure patients wherein we have to replace the diseased heart with a donor heart. The process of course is we have to commence by doing various investigations to assess the suitability of the recipient who has heart failure to see whether his overall conditioning is such the other systems and the other organs of the body can accept a transplant. Next up we do various investigations to see the suitability for a heart transplant. Now once all these tests are done then we have a multidisciplinary team which assesses overall if the patient is suitable for a heart transplant. Once the team has decided then we list this patient for a heart transplant. To get a donor heart it's likely to take anywhere from three to five months or maybe in some times some instances even longer. So once we get a suitable heart the diseased heart is excised out by the surgeon and the donor heart is put in that position and if you rewarm the heart after the anastomosis the heart automatically starts beating again and this gives new life to the patient who had a very very poor quality of life due to heart failure with extensive symptoms of exhaustion swelling of feet distension of abdomen and a very very, very poor quality of life this again comes as a new lease of life wherein they can walk they can perform their day-to-day -day activities there is even an olympics for the transplant patients where, wherein they can showcase their prowess in sports and of course above all lead a life of dignity. Mm -hmm.